Put up your hands. And step away from that safe. I'm afraid you got me wrong, Sheriff. I didn't do anything. It any looks of it. like we've got you right. Reloaded, eh? He didn't do this alone. Where's the rest of your gang? You're wrong, Sheriff. I didn't do this. I came here to see Ed Rogers. Yes? You saw him, all right, before he saw you. I... Shut up. Save your breath. You're going to need it. This looks like a job for the coroner. We'll lock this one up and round up the others. All right. Fine work, Matt. It's a good thing you can hear or we wouldn't have got this hombre. I want to see you later. Listen, Sheriff, I have to... You'll have company when we pick up the rest of your gang. See if you can find Sally Rogers. Someone's got to break the news to her.
All right. My deal. Spike. Round up the boys. All right, Marvin. Hey, the boss wants to see us. Tommy, come on, wake up. Get the rest of the bunch. You did a fine job of getting rid of old man Rogers, boys. Now we'll get his niece to sell us the halfway house. And we'll own the whole of Paiute Pass for 20 miles. Yeah, and we'll buy it with her own money, too. Where's the 30,000? Well, where's the money? We didn't get it. It wasn't in the safe. What do you mean you didn't get it? I'm telling you, we couldn't find it. And you call yourselves bad men. I should have left you where I found you, Brandon Cabs. And Rogers' niece, where was she? She wasn't there. Oh, that's it. So the girl outsmarted you, huh? Well, she knows where it is. Well, that's more than we do, and we tore the joint apart. Yeah? And she was just one jump ahead of you. They told me you wanted to see me, Sheriff. Yes, Miss Sally, I... Well, if, if it's about my uncle, I already know. See? Who told you? Why, well, I guess you hear those things. I'm sorry. Mighty sorry. And if it's any satisfaction to you, we got one of them in custody. I'd like you to take a look at him. Maybe you've seen him before. He's in there. Matt, the mute's back, Sheriff. You said you wanted to talk to him about them shots he heard. You better get to him quick. He's getting ready to leave town again. I'll be back in a minute, Miss Sally. Sit down. You 
don't look like a killer. Well, I'm not. But give me a chance, I could prove it. Could you? You don't think I'd kill the man I was sent to see, do you? Were you sent to see my uncle? Was your uncle Ed Rogers? He was. Looks like the investigation's over, as far as I'm concerned. No, it's just beginning. Meet me at the halfway house at sunrise. may be right, Matt. Well, Miss Sally, did you recognize him? Well, I, I talked with him, but you see, I don't think I ever saw him before. The prisoner got away. He did. No, the halfway house is not for sale. I appreciate your offer, but well, I'm going to try and carry on. <laughs> There's no need to worry about that. They took it all. Just the same. by Pinnacle Rock.
door. I was afraid you wouldn't get here. Well, so was I. And if I'm not mistaken, the sheriff isn't very far behind. We have to work fast. The gang didn't get what they were after, and they'll be back. Yes, and that isn't all you have to worry about. I owe you a lot. But don't you realize that in helping me get away, you made yourself a party to a crime? Why, I never thought of that. Well, why didn't you show the sheriff that letter? That would have cleared you. Yes, and spoiled everything before I got started. No, my orders were to work alone. Well, what are we going to do? Well, uh, I'd like to hear what happened. Well, I found where he camped last night, but no trace of him. You know, I've been thinking. The Rogers girl is the only one to have seen the prisoner. I think we'll talk to her. I was right. There's his horse. What about you? You can't be found here. Don't worry, you won't find me. in here somewhere. Search the place.
one. There's a fellow heading in here. Do you know him? Never seen him before. We'll take care of him. Well, this is a fine way to welcome a man. There ain't no one welcome here. I'll just take you inside and let the boss look you over. Come on. How did you get in here? I fell in. By way of the waterfall. When I found that tunnel, you didn't expect me to stay out there with a posse on my heels, did you? Dodging the law, eh? Who do you work with? Nobody. I ride alone. When the coast is clear, I'd like to be on my way. Oh, no, you don't. You're riding with us. We're taking no chances of anyone tipping off this hideout. Well, that suits me. Give him back his gun. One of you boys fix him up with a dry shirt. I'll fix you up. Look here, boss. You're making a mistake turning him loose. Oh, I know what I'm doing. He's the fellow the sheriff picked up for the job you pulled at the halfway house. Oh, he's wanted all right. Only I don't trust him too much. Just keep your eye on him. Don't let him get out of here. We might be able to use him. And if we can't, we can always leave him in the tunnel. Thanks. That's all right. When are we going to get the halfway house? There's gold passing through there every day now. The girl won't sell out. There's ways of making her sell. Maybe you're right. I've got an idea. Get a couple of the boys. Two she hasn't seen before. Hey, Slim. Joe. Take this to Sally Rogers. Get her. Bring her here. Make sure she doesn't see where she's going. Might not be a bad idea to get him out of here before the girl arrives. Yeah, that's right. You'll be needing a hat, one of mine. Thanks. What are those for? The sheriff's been mighty active lately. So we're getting my target practice. Fixing them up. Oh, I think I got one of your cards. <laughs> yeah, that's one of them. I punch them and the boss signs them. Come on outside, I'll show you.
Watch him jump. Look out, partner. You might have blown off the whole mountainside. Well, not with a 45. Oh, no? Come here, I'll show you. We got dynamite planted all over this place. So we can blow off the whole tunnel entrance. If we ever get in the corner, all the boss has to do is press the plunger in his room. And we're not through yet. We're putting more of it right over there. So be kind of careful where you sling that 45. Well, I guess that's a good idea. We're not open. We'll be closed until after the services for my uncle. Yeah, we heard. It's too bad that... Well, we was asked to give you this note. I'm not going with you. Yes, you will. Oh. Boys are coming in with the Rogers girl. Fine. Now we'll get somewhere. Yeah. Where? Where's Matt? Why, his note says it. Never mind about Matt. Now you answer my questions and I'll see that you both go free. The boys called on you the other day. But they didn't get what they were sent for. Where's the money? I don't know. Oh, you don't know, huh? No. Perhaps if I give you time to think it over, you might be able to remember. Oh, I don't know what you're talking about. Let me go. Lock her up. We'll give her a chance to refresh her memory. You better stay away from there if you know what's good for you. The boss is kind of touchy about some things. Oh. I see. No, I'm not. You've got to trust me. I'm going for help to get you out of here. Oh, I do trust you. This is the key to the strong box. You better move it first. Well, where is it? In a compartment in front of the bar. Now, don't worry, and no matter who questions you, don't talk.
No. I don't believe you. You're just like the rest of them. I don't want your help, and I don't know where the money is. Bring her out here. We'll make her talk. Come on, get up. Get up out of there. Hey, you, get up. Go on. Oh, I've had enough of this. Where's the money? No one ever makes a fool out of Marvin Black. Matt the Mute. He won't get away this time. Come and get me! walking into a trap. Now I'll give you just one more chance to tell me.
Where have you been? Looking for the money that you couldn't get. And I found it. Yeah? Well, where is it? In the compartment in front of the bar at the halfway house. And I believed in you. So it is there, eh? The sheriff! on him, boys, and we'll get the others before they get to the halfway house. Take him out.
No use you trying to get away, young fella. Where's Black? In the halfway house. Well, that's the end of Matt the Mute. And Marvin Black, they're one and the same person. I guess that ends my investigation, too. This will explain. Oh, yes, and uh, your money is in those saddlebags. I reckon this clears you, son. I hope you'll forgive me for doubting you. Oh, that's all right. I suppose you'll be riding along. Yes, but not alone. <laughs>